my tastes are very singular. Christian doesn't have a lot of like funny moments. It's all behind his eyes. I think that Jamie, he's got like a sparkle in his eye and he's so playful and he's got such a heart when he's acting and he's being really serious and you still like see the little boy in his eyes, which I think is sort of a, a part of Christian that everybody likes. What would I get out of this? Me. The Red Room's like, He's got pretty good style. He's done it. It's, it's pretty cool. That was the thing I was really amazed by the Red Room. Like, it was so, it's actually, it's really like stylish and, you know, beautiful. And like, mm -hmm. um, it doesn't feel dirty or, you know, anything like that, you know? Yeah. There's I agree. a lot of dirty things in there, if you know what I mean? But it's like, it is a very like plush, cool, sophisticated, classy, you know, room. I was like, <laughs> what's in here? What are in these drawers? What's in the cabinets? And it was insane. I needed a few, I needed like a good half hour in there to discover everything. It was really amazing. <laughs> it was like one of the most beautiful sets I've ever seen. Everything is completely real. There's nothing phony about it. You don't knock on a wall and it's like hollow and falls over. It's so crazy and intricate. Ready? Whenever you are. I, okay. I think the hardest scene to shoot, or the one that I felt most pressure with was the, the introduction scene, you know, the interview scene, the first time they're introduced to each other. Because it just means so much, that moment, and there's so much at play, and, uh, and we really sort of felt that, you know. We gave ourselves two days to film it, which was cool, because, you know, we had time to really think it through and get it right, and so that was probably the most difficult sort of, uh, challenge in terms of scenes and stuff. The hardest one that I, I, I didn't really know um, that it would be this difficult, but the scene where Christian uses a flogger on Anna is one of the first scenes in the Red Room where she's tied to the bed with her legs and arms. And that was difficult because, I mean, not only you do it like all day, I was blindfolded and tied, so your senses are sort of taken away, and no matter how much you know that the situation is not real, it's really, it's like a really bizarre thing, because it's not, we weren't really doing that, and it wasn't <laughs> like a sexual environment, but still, when the camera's cut, I'm still blindfolded and still tied, and it's like, it was a really just emotional day. It was like, you know, you become so much more sensitive when, you can't see or move. Hearts and flowers? That's not something I know. Anna, please. It's you that's changing me. It was really important to me that the people on set took the moments where we were being really vulnerable seriously. It's not an easy thing to do. It's, you know, you you are completely naked and a lot of the times Anastasia's like physically naked and then also going through some really bizarre set of emotions. So it was important to me to have everybody respect that and we always had a very closed set and it was really protected and private. Yeah, I mean, there's things that we went through, like lawyers and stuff, about like what, what's seen on camera and what's not. No, I, d I don't think there's, there's nothing I was like, apart from like body parts. No frontal nudity. It, that was the thing. <laughs> Maybe coveralls, so you protect your clothes? Could just take all my clothes off. Okay, no clothes. I mean, no coveralls. Jamie is really funny and we get along really well, so when I read the book, I found humor in it and I saw how clever she can be. It was important to me to play that part up or at least like really get those comedic moments so that it sort of balances the moments that have a lot of depth. Otherwise, it's too serious and you have to, ha you have to like give yourself a break when you're watching it. You know, you need a minute to laugh. <laughs> you're making it for the fans, right? And there's like plenty of them. The most exciting part is offering it to the fans and being like, here, this is what we've done, we're part of it, I hope you respond well to it. This is where it gets, it's really fun making it, obviously, but this is really fun, you know, getting a chance to share it.